Hello everyone. So today's topic will be seven segment decoder where we will be putting BCD uh, and it will return seven segment decoder as you know like digital um, numbers or can say showing in seven segment so let's start with the circuit so for that we can create a circuit using analyze circuit so for that uh, I already saved a truth table where it is the truth table for BCD to 7 segment decoder. Here we can see that there is 4 types of inputs and 7 types of outputs. And if you know that uh, in decoder, the decoder is n into 2 to the power n. So as that for you know for inputs you think that yes much less outputs we can put the rest of them in don't care segment so we can consider it with that and let's create the truth table using this image so for our inputs we need here you can see that there is labeled as a b c d and a smaller hand a b c d a f g for our better understanding uh, we will use w w x y and z and for the outputs we will use a b c d e f and g and then in the truth table we will select as according to this truth table so for the first row it will be this g will be 0 and rest of them will be 1 so 1 1 1 1 and 1 and for the 1 it will be zero. this 2 will be 1 like b and c and rest of them will be 0 so this is 0 this is 0 it will be 0 0 0 and for 2 or 1 0 here you can see that we have a b 1 and uh, 1 d e 1 e uh, and g 1 so according to that we need to place here So, um, like putting the values of here, here to here, you will, you can do it by memorizing it, or you can do a by, by uh, making an any truth table, and then you can put it here. So, I am skipping the parts of putting the. Um, inputs sorry outputs or completing the truth table and then we can do the rest of works so yeah okay so I um, place the values in the truth table and as you can see the rest of three values are uh, rest of three not 
uh, rest of six values are not coded we can fill them in the don't care condition so we don't need to um, input any of values it can be as default so yeah after pale we can have the circuit using the truth table so yeah this is our circuit and i can remove other parts so yeah this is our circuit of seven segment circuit and for the ic we need to be little careful like first you need to increase the size i'll prefer it like this size okay so for the inputs and outputs you need to ensure that it is in serial so first deleting that and starting with the inputs so this is our first input which is w i'll put it here then this is our x input making sure to have a much gap between them then our third input i'll pl place it here and our fourth input i'll place it Okay, so our input is coded, and for the output, I'll put first one here, then here, then here, here, here. the last one goes here so this is our IC now we can color it and also level it as you wish ok so I am done with leveling and uh, with the color now for our main theme so first i will put it here and for this we need to first add four inputs so as our first one second one and the rest of them ok so our input is connected now uh, for the output so first we have to go to the input or output folder then here we can see several things from here we have to select seven segment display so we'll grab it here okay so now for the outputs we have to connect this to this uh, at first i like to level them up so for that i i'll level them up then i will connect the outputs to the seven segment display okay so i have leveled them up now time to understand i cannot 
increase the size of the seven segments so it will be a little difficult to uh, see but I will explain like at first I would explain that this is I am considering this as one two three four and uh, for them I am considering it five six seven eight so the A will be connected to 3. So this is our 3. So you can see it is connected. And for B, it will be connected to 4. So yeah. Uh, then for C, C will be connected to seven so this is the seven then d will be connected to six then e will be connected to five like this and for if if will be connected to this one I mean two and G will be connected to one here a thing to be noted that you need to see if it has any cross connection like this if it has any cross connection then your output won't be uh, coming correctly so you need to focus on that too and I'll be putting this in the middle now for the testing we can test as like here is zero so you can see the digital display showing zero so for one sorry for one you can see that one for two is two here is 3 and for 4 here is 4 for 5 here is 5 for 6 here is 6 for 7 here is 7 and for 8 here is 8 for 9 here is 9 so by seeing this we can consider it as our circuit is okay and this is the full se 7 segment DCD to 7 segment decoder so that is for today see you in the next video till then have a nice day see ya